हेलो एवरी वन दिस इज वृशाली एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल इन प्रीवियस सेशन वी डिस्कस अबाउट डिफरेंट स्विचिंग टेक्निक्स विथ एग्जाम्पल आई हैव मैंशन अ कम्प्लीट कंप्यूटर नेटवर्क सब्जेक्ट प्ले लिस्ट लिंक इन बिलो डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स नाउ इन टूडे सेशन वी विल डिस्कस द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक दैट इज इंट्रोडक्शन अबाउट आई पी वी फोर एंड आई पी वी सिक्स एड्रेसेस लेट स्टार्ट द सेशन एट द एंड ऑफ द सेशन यू शुड लर्न अबाउट टाइप्स ऑफ आई पी एड्रेस एंड पब्लिक एंड प्राइवेट एड्रेस कॉन्सेप्ट Let's see all these points one by one. Now, the first topic is what exactly IP address. Here, IP stands for Internet Protocol Address. In network, there are multiple devices are present. So every device is having their own unique number, own unique address, which is called as IP address. So by using IP address, it is easy to find out which devices perform which type of action. IP address is divided into the two types like IPv4 and IPv6. First we understand the declaration of IP address. See here, this is a example of IP address like 192.168.10.26. So this is a IP address of one particular device, one particular computer. Here first three numbers indicate the network address and last number indicate the host address. Means in particular network like 192.168.10 under that network dot 26 this host this pc this device is present so this is called as ip address now let discuss in detail what exactly ip v4 address here v4 it indicates the version 4 and this ip v4 address introduced in 1981 so IPv4 address is most commonly used IP address everywhere IPv4 address is used by using IPv4 address it is easy to find out which types of devices and how many computers are present in network see here this is a structure of IPv4 address here original address is 192 168 10 100 so first number consider as first octet second number consider as second octet similarly third octet and four octet means there are total four octet now this is a decimal number this is a address is in the form of decimal now convert this decimal number into the binary format like this is a 192 8 bit numbers are there right this is again 8 bit this is 8 bit and this is 8 bit means the length of the complete address is 32 bit so ipv4 address length is 32 bit there are total 4 octets then ipv4 address range is start from 0 to 255 number and in this address only numeric or numbers are present there are 4.3 billion devices are used unique ip address the best example of ipv4 address is domain name system see when you search particular website particular link on network on browser so sub so at that time your device used the ipv4 address of a particular website which hosted on particular server so that server ipv4 address is fetch when you use a particular website so domain name system is a best example of ipv4 address these are the again some examples of ipv4 address now the next is advantages of ipv4 as we discussed earlier this is a widely used ipv4 address there are most devices are compatible in network by using this address this is a 32 bit addressing system which is very easy to understand easy to implement and they also follow different network routing algorithms means in network multiple devices share information with each other they communicate accurately and properly by using ip address now the disadvantages of ipv4 address is there is a limitations of address space means only 4.3 billion unique address generated only 4.3 billion devices are used ipv4 address so as per the demand of new devices new technologies this address is not suitable there are only limited security features so all these disadvantages are overcome in next ipv6 address so this is all about ipv4 
Now, the next address is IPv6 address. It is the most recent version. And this IPv6 address introduced in Internet Engineering Task Force in 1998. They resolve all the difficulties of IPv4 and which is also known as Internet Protocol Next Generation Address. See here, this is the structure of IPv6 address. In IPv4 address, there are only 32 bit. There is 128 bit. See here. And in this address, there are some numbers, some alphabets are there. Means this is an alphanumeric address. The range is start from 0 to 6 5 5 3 5. Means 4 time F. Which contain all the alphanumeric numbers. And there are total 8 octets are there. Right? The, that's why. The length is 128 bit and here 340 trillion devices are used this IPv6 address means there are total 340 trillion unique IP addresses are there. Similarly, in this IPv6 address, first 48 bit are the network part and last 64 bits are the client part that is host part, host device and between 16 bits which is called as subnet ID. Subnet ID used to find out subnetworks. There are larger networks. This network again divided into the subnetworks, right? So that was indicated by the subnet ID. Generally, IPv6 address used in all the demanding services like Google services, then Internet of Thing devices like home automation systems and where all the latest and updated devices are used like different mobile networks, 4G, 5G networks are there. Cloud computing services are there like Azure, Amazon. So all the latest technologies, latest devices are used IPv6 address. Now, the next point is what are the advantages of IPv6? The best advantages is they transmit data in real time manner. There are most satellites are connected in the particular network. And by using satellites, you can show some live cricket matches than some uh, streaming web series, right? So they use IPv6 address. Also, they support authenticate, accurate communication between sender and receiver. And IPv6 address provide more security as compared to IPv4 because they perform encryption, description, this kind of processes, operations in network. And IPv6 address also able to process a particular data packets fastly. They send and receive. These operations are performed fastly, accurately in network. The disadvantages of IPv6 is IPv6 sometimes take long time as compared to IPv4 for performing a particular uh, streaming or live matches. IPv4, IPv6 machine cannot communicate directly with each other. They can't compatible with each, each other, right? Sometimes what happen? IPv6 cannot run on IPv4 capable computer devices, okay? Because all the devices, all the computer systems generally use IPv4 address. So IPv6 systems, IPv6 devices are not compatible on IPv4. So this kind of problems have generated in particular networking system. So this is all about IPv6. Now, again in computer network, there are two terms like private address and public address. The best example of private address is Wi-Fi network. There is a particular Wi-Fi in particular institute or in your home, right? So multiple computers, multiple mobiles, like speakers, all these devices are connected to the one Wi-Fi. So this is called as your private address. They have their own unique IP address. And the best example of public address is internet. There is internet service provider. They provides you a particular public IP address or router that you need to connect a particular systems, right? So connect to the internet at that time public address is used. So this is a basic concept of private address and public address. So this is all about IPv4 and IPv6 address. Thank you. Keep learning.